Okay, this might sound totally crazy, but there's a chance you have an atom in your body that once belonged to William Shakespeare. Yeah, the Shakespeare. To be or not to be is now possibly in your left elbow. Here's how it works. Everything, you, me, tacos, trees, even Shakespeare, is made of atoms. And atoms don't just disappear when someone dies, they get recycled. When people, animals, or plants break down, their atoms go back into the earth, into the air, into water, and eventually into new things. That includes you. So over the last 400 years since Shakespeare died, his atoms have been floating around, getting mixed into food, plants, oceans, even pizza. And because there are so many atoms in the world, like more atoms in a glass of water than glasses of water in all the oceans, the chances are pretty good that some of his atoms have ended up in you. Which means, you and Shakespeare, atomic buddies. So next time you write something dramatic or feel like quoting, just say, thanks, Will, we share a molecule. Matter is never really gone, it just finds a new script.